Rover bot today. Let's go for it. We got E4 here. We'll see what he does and we'll try to look for ways to exploit that or maybe build a position. He's going to beat me. Okay. We'll see about that. Okay, I think a lot of the engines like to push here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pre-move capture. If he does that, if he does not, uh, oh, okay, we got that out of the way. And then we're just going to try to develop as quickly as we can. Again, if there's anything we see that's exploitable, we'll go for that. There. A couple of options. I could just push the pawn here and leave a middle uh, that's congested, or I could open this up. I think most engines would prefer to open it up, but we'll see here. I don't see pawn taking here because that allows me to develop the bishop. But you never know. It is he is rated twelve hundred, so there is a possibility it could go differently. We'll see. We'll take there. I'm thinking if pawn takes, I'll develop the knight and then oh no, queen took there. I don't want to trade queens, but I do want to stay ahead with development. So I'm going to go here. If we trade, we trade. If not, you know, now we can hit this pawn here. I can also cast it quicker. We'll see here. Okay. Uh, we will just, I guess, we'll take this. Because that will give us a rock. And give us a lead there, and then... I'm not going to worry about a fast pawn here. Yet. I may have to later, but we'll see. Yep. Got a knight defending. I've got a bishop defending. There's no rook here. He's one, two, three moves away from getting a rook out there. I like your chances here. Go for the castle. Pretty much all we have to worry about is this pawn, I think, at the moment. And then just figure out a way to get our two rooks active and then go after this. Now oh, he's bringing out some help. Okay. Let's get our knight out.
If he starts developing more, we will try to go for a check here. Yep, that one comes out. Okay. Actually, that's a beautiful move for us because now we can pen the knight. A lot of leverage here now because with a knight pen, we could do something like this. But also, the knight is not defended by any piece other than the king. So if the king were to try to help, it's not going to work. Get our bishop out there. Idea is we can activate the rook. One of the rooks, anyway. Or we can just trade there. So now I'm thinking like one of the rooks to d1, probably the a rook. And then, so we'll go here and then we'll take there. Okay, no problem here. We can just put another pen in place. Both knights are penned. Knight can't go after this. Another thought is to play like bishop here and leverage that. Uh, I'm going to deal with pawn threat first. We got both rooks in good position. <coughs> I guess we should just call Mark Rober. Pin it up, Rober. Do I take? Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Let's let's take this one first. Looking good here. Got an overload there. This is pinned. Looking real good here. That doesn't do anything. I'm thinking like discovery, right? I go here, get a discover check, and yeah. This is looking really good. I think this game's going to be over shortly. And that, no, no, that won't do it. There is. That won't do it. We'll get there, though. Let's go here. All right. That doesn't do it, does it? We gotta go here and then move the, one of the rooks. No, that doesn't do it either. Wow. I'm misfiring here. This should do it at some point. There we go.